Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Regalia of Minden Monarchs. Just completed one area, so the Kingdom Quests are done. The thing is, we have the Archive Panic thing, which is right here. So we gotta do this. Let's go. Double Turn Archive dedicated to the God of Paperwork. No, no, God of Bureaucracy. A little bit different. A little bit different. Actually, it wasn't the God of Diplomacy? Yeah, I thought it was the God of Diplomacy, not Bureaucracy. I don't know. Anyway. I know we should do. Can I save a game? I can. Um, am I out of save spots? Saving is not possible here. What the hell? I need to go to the castle. I don't want to go all the way back right now, so we're gonna go here. Hopefully, you know, the game doesn't crash. We'll see. Go inside. Enter fourth. Let's do it. A long, long time later. <sighs> that took us longer than expected. Was this the room, 294? Young Master, I am unsure whether we have even on the right floor. What? I no. not recall anyone giving us a number as high as 294. Sounds good to me. Sure they did, I think. We won't know until we come in. Go in, you mean. <sighs> it's not going to end well. Walk into somebody's quarters. Even later. Eh. This doesn't look like the archives. Rightly so. An astute observation, Master K, especially since it's pitch black. Ah. Oh, come on, there were thousands of doors. Also, it's not. I think I can see a door. Not pitch black, he means. You really can't. <laughs> what was that? There it is again. Why was some monster be in the archives? It's got to be someone with a really bad health condition or something. In your guard, young master, we need some light. Okay, no, they're just zombies here. Maybe they're bureaucratic zombies? Okay. I don't know what I was expecting. Tickets, numbers. Yeah, okay, they're bureaucratic zombies. It speaks curious. You have ticket? Getting weird all the time, isn't it? He's most likely referring to the piece of parchment in his hand. One, three, four. Is that his position in his line or his age? Maybe both. Waiting tickets. Wait, what? Tickets. We don't have any tickets or numbers. Uh oh. Oh, number? Yeah. Line cutters. Uh. Line cutters, line cutters, line cutters. And we're going to fight. We're going to fight, aren't we? Probably. Reach the door with the whole party. Beat three enemies with a single ability. Defeat an enemy with at least three negative effects. All right. Um, so the door is the green marker. Okay. All right. We just need to get past them somehow. Hmm. Can I look at those objectives again? Reach the door with the whole party. Okay. So, Signy might be pretty good here. Alice, of course, will be too, because they're grouped up nicely. All right, Lordemar, or sorry, Levant, you go right there. I mean, he is from Lordemar. Alice here, Signy here, A and back. All right. Here we go! And you should definitely shield up Levant. Strike now! We move a lot now, of zombies. Yes. Um, you can pounce on this one. Oh, nope, not yet. Um, come over here. And then pounce. You can pounce in the middle, but I think taking these guys one at a time. Well, 992 health, yeah. Do not get overzealous here. Let's get dangerous. We really don't need to defeat them all, we just need to get past them. Come over here. Down a fireball right there. Okay. Not so bad. Pity you can't do that again. Um, how about... Blitz and then... Can't quench this one! Blazing Barrier right there. Orvin right there. There, no, that would get Signy. Right here is good. 
someone's gotta draw the line. Do not presume too much. Okay. I'm gonna stun some of these guys. Maybe not a bad idea. Holy dive right there. Okay. Now some of them have to go through the fire to touch him, which is good. Okay, just some hits, no big. Oh, Alice gets hit. That is big. He's gonna go a long way. You're going into the fire, thank you. Big ol' whiff. Uh, at this point, I kind of want a Lord of Fire so that he can do a big old move, but we have to build up to it. Leave this to me. Okay, definitely shield up Avant here. He's gonna need it. Um, what else you can do? You can get over somewhere. I guess follow this way, because at some point Levant's gonna re be able to recharge his holy dive and get like. Real close to the door. We just need to wait for that. On the prowl. Oh man, I wanted to use whirlwind, but that's gonna be really bad here. So instead, 437. Use pounce. Use savage roar. They could panic. I don't know if they do panic, but it's possible. Yeah, we could try it. <laughs> Oh, no, they resisted the panic. That's bad. All right, well, run away anyway. They might get up on K if we run away. Well, I don't want her to get knocked down either, so the run away. Is on. You can use a fireball, but I think you can come over here and then use your fireball. Let it flow. Okay, some good bouncing. Destroyed one of them. I march. And get some shields. Burn yeah. And we just wait for them to do the thing. Okay, some we're gonna miss. That's good. Yeah. All right, this guy. And the shields are gone. Okay, yeah, okay, gets hit. Okay. Hmm, is Lamont gonna live? The wallops are pretty rough. Okay, the fire is gone, that's unfortunate. Let's go! But we could call in the Fire Lord now. Definitely shield up Levant. Strike now! And then keep running. On the prowl. You hitting this guy up here would probably be good. We do need to hit him. We need to get past him. Let's get dangerous. Okay, you need to call him the Fire Lord, I think. So that it takes some of the heat off of him. So that means you need to come all the way back down here. And call in the Fire Lord. Yeah, like, right here is good. Come out and play, baby. Okay, can you do... Okay, Ring of Fire will hurt Levant, so don't do that. Can't really move, so... You guy's almost dead though, right? Yeah, strike him. There you go. Now you can move. So if Levant moves first, yeah, let's just wait for it. I follow. Okay, so Levant can move like down here. You can probably strike and then move down. So let's do that. Let's move you that way. Crumble. 
Okay, does that move? Yeah, there we go. We can move this way now. Move this way now, please. Could you, can you move this way, please? Not quite where I wanted you to go. How about there? There you go. Okay, good. Some of are gonna surround the Lord of Fire, which I'm okay with. Ow. Ow. A lot of owls here. Not great. Lord of Mars not getting hit as much. Or sorry. Levant. My brain. Okay, shield's gone. One more guy hits him. Go with. That's good. Okay, but I think Levant can now holy dive. Okay, big go whiff there too. Good. All right, our turn. Leave this to me. He can't shield up Levant, but we don't need to. I think we just come over here. Um, nope, don't do that. That. Cause we don't need to be next to her to shield her up. We can just do that. There you go. We move now. Yes. Um, you have 755. So I can get next to the door. I guess I could whirlwind and then get next to the door. Yeah, it's not gonna die, but at least do that. And then you get next to the door. Progress of a sort. You shoot the fireball off, maybe it'll bounce. It did, that was pretty good. In fact, do that again. I'm just getting started. There we go. All right, and then you can run over here. You're probably gonna get walloped by this guy. Do not presume too much. Okay, we do have holy dive, so you're gonna holy dive over here, and that gets you pretty close to the yeah. Actually, you can go right into the door. Close enough. All right, you can do your ring of fire thing. Another one drops. But you can come over here and maybe distract these guys from doing anything too big. Oh, except he's gone. Alright, never mind. We can get to the door. We can totally line cut here. Yeah, zombies don't have the range. They can't get... Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Do I want to know what he threw there? Because where do you get the meat? Oh man, Alice is gonna drop if we're not careful. And Alice get there. I think she can. Definitely gotta shield up Alice. Watch this! Unfortunately, we're here for another turn at least. Yeah, because Kate doesn't have the movement to be able to do much. And now he's blocking the way, so Alice can't even get over there. Shoot. We move now, yes? Okay, let's see. Um we can kill some of these guys. 432, 379, 75. This guy could die. I can't get to him though, but I can do this. He's at 87. This guy's totally killable. If Alice bounces a fireball off of these guys' heads and does it well, let's get dangerous. They could both die right here. Oh, we dodged it. Beautiful. Son of a biscuit. I'm about to lose control. If she doesn't do I this. I like it. If she doesn't do this, then she dies. Okay, good, good, good. We're alive. Beautiful. Do not presume too much. All right. Um, how much health do you have? 162. So you can't really take another hit. We're gonna have to, which sucks, but. Here, we'll, um, we'll shield off this part so they can't get over here. Radiance everlasting. Okay. Yeah. Now he has to go around. Yeah. This guy will come up and hit. We can hit him. Oh, it was a miss. 
That is so lucky. Okay, only three Leave zombies left. To me. Not too bad. Unfortunately, we can't actually get in because this guy's blocking us. That sucks. Um, come over here and build up Levant, I guess. We move now, yes? She can come over here and pounce. Yeah, right there. And he's not dead yet. Should wait until these guys surround us and do whirlwind. She can totally live through that. Or Alice comes over here and does a fireball and it bounces really, really well. Inferno wouldn't be bad either. Um, let's see if you can't really do Inferno in the right places. All right, so how about a line of fire right there? No line of sight. These urns are totally blocking us. Unless she has a line of sight to do that. Nope, no line of sight to do that either. Line of sight to hit these guys. Nope, they're too far away. Oh, Alice is just fucked. All right, we can smash this guy. Smite the infidel. There you go. Your penance is death. <laughs> One guy's going a long way. One guy's going right up to Sydney. Okay. Okay, we are going to be able to get to the door. We can totally just manage this right now. We can just go over here. Build up Signy. Strike now! We move now, yes? Signy cannot kill this guy. She would like to, but she can't. Whirlwind would come close. Well, maybe if it crits. <laughs> nope, no way. No way, no how. Come on, baby. Light my fire! I didn't move Signy to, to the door. I'm a dummy. I'm a big old dummy. We could have ended this right now. Okay, well, fireball this guy. Catch! And one more time, we'll probably just kill him. I'm about to lose control, and I think I like it. There we go. So he's down. One zombie left. We could have just ended this, I but. Follow. So it goes. Um, sure, shield everyone. Only Nova will shield everyone, yeah. Bask in the power of the sun. It shouldn't matter, but the zombie is going to throw his meat. Yeah. Most likely. Okay, now we just need to move Signy. Um, so here, shield Signy here. Strike now! And then. Yes, over. yes. You move right there, and we're done. Mission successful. Okay, not so bad. Finish that battle. Firewalls don't have to be boring. Yeah. Okay, Is we found a lot of books. Finally! This definitely looks like the archives. Bumbling and blundering through seems to have worked indeed. Hey, given our situation, I'll take any shreds of luck we can get. Of course, now you have a thousand books to look through. This will take some time. Also, this does not seem safe. This is how the Library of Alex and Dredda burned, okay? That's not actually true. You know, the Library of Alex and Dredda didn't actually... There wasn't one critical event. There was actually, like, a series of fires. Slowly destroyed the library. And there was the very last one, which I think was the fifth in its history, something like that. The fifth over a century, when they're like, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> We're done. So the loss of the library along Zedra, it was a tragedy, of course, but it was a gradual loss, much more gradual than most people think. <laughs> Welcome to my parlor, little morsels. If this is a sentient, sapient spider, I'm going to be really freaked out. Have you come to play? <laughs> Wondrous. Really? Who talks like that? Show yourself, foul villain. Or fifth at least. Oh, but I will! Have a seat! The vamp we're gonna fight the vampire? Why? Why? Let's talk about it. He doesn't want to talk. Beat the final boss. 
Win without missing or having your opponent dodge once, not up to me. Win with one combatant deployed? No. No. It's not going to happen. Not going to do that challenge. Okay, not that we have a lot of room. Okay, so I'd love to put in fire here, but I think... Maybe not Lodomar. Lodomarian. Maybe everyone else. Yeah, I think this setup could work. Let's go. He goes first. Oh, At great. Your side. Blinded. All right. Well, charge him anyway. 9,000 health. And it missed. Mm. I'm skillful. So much for that. Um, definitely shield of this guy. Yes, yes. Okay, so you can probably leap behind him. <laughs> um, big old whiff. Is he just supposed to destroy us now? Let's get dangerous. I think he's supposed to destroy us now. I don't think there's any way we do this. We keep missing. He has 9,999. We have no line of sight either. Do, yeah. Fire. Right there. Someone's gotta draw the line. Oh. Lights oh. out. Okay. That was. We get one experience point. Are you shitting me right now? So we could. You know, I'm gonna restart the battle. It's silly, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna use Alice here because there's 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 techniques that never miss, right? Like for instance, fire thing. So she's just gonna take care of this. My kind of odds. All right, she's blinded, but that doesn't matter. Does not matter at all because you can do blazing barrier right on this guy. There you go. There we go. Now we get all the rewards. I mean, the treasure chance, it didn't actually work. Even though we got plus 30% treasure chance, it didn't actually work at all. Okay. Well, worth a shot anyway. Oh, Theo. Oh, we can totally get this guy. Maybe if we played our cards right, we might be able to get this guy to be our party, be in our party. Oh, this didn't go well at all. Of course, we only know that because we looked through the through the items at the merchant, right? So that was a bit of a spoiler. Well, I meant well. Damn it. Young master? Yes, Griffith? This person was not a villain at all. In indeed. Not even mini boss material. Hey, what? <clears throat> what is that supposed to mean? I am evil. Respect me. Weirdness sure follows you, young master. Not that I wanted to be that way. Uh, shall we look into the documents? Stop ignoring me. Would you mind? We're looking for some really important family documents here. Documents? Wait, so you're not here to vanquish me. Why would we want to do that? Well, I assumed that you were heroes sent here by the local populace, no? Surely my campaign of terror is finally paying off? Is his terror the terror of bureaucracy? Because that only goes so far. Campaign of terror. Um, hello, the whole vampire thing? Vampire? Where? Come out, foul beast! Ah, bollocks. Me! It's me! I'm a vampire! Are you sure about this? I assumed you were just, you know, sun deficient. Yes, I'm sure. I'm also sure I would get apoplexy right now if I wasn't, you know, already dead. Okay. So can we look for our stuff now? I'll naturally go right... Uh, wait, wait, wait. No, halt! Lauren, Lauren, Lauren... No, nothing. I don't know. If he uses this as the lair, might be able to, might be able to help. Nothing in sight here either. 
Given the sheer volume of material, are you sure this is an efficient approach, Master K? No, but there doesn't seem to be a better solution. A guy right here living with all these books. Um, actually, there is. If he says there's a card catalog, I'm going to laugh. You said Lauren, right? Purple section, shelf that third row, collection number uh, 398D. What? I was bored. What else was I supposed to do around here for 60 years? Well, reading seems like a good way to pass the time, sure. There it is. The file with the family crest. D.R.L. Duke Robert Lauren. Dare I say jackpot? Excellent find, young master. Sure, praise K. Never mind, Theo just helped out there. Wait, and those? Are those sketches? Building plans? Look here. This is oddly reminiscent of the layout of our castle. Hmm. Well, in any case, no point in lingering here. I say we bring those back home and let the girls take a closer look at it. Very well. Wait! Uh, aren't you forgetting something? Like what? Well, me. I've been living, or rather, unliving, a lie. It's clear that this was a poor choice for a villain's lair. Nobody ever comes here. Not even the priests. Just what am I supposed to do now? Take me with you. I know I might have not made the best first impression, but give me a chance. Please, I need some fresh material. It's so hard to be evil these days. While I cannot endorse his motivation, I have to admit there's some refreshing enthusiasm to his actions. Are you insane, Griffith? Have you taken too many hits to the head lately? Has the blonde actually leached deep inside your skull and throttled what remains of your reason? Okay, maybe. That and he did help us. That's true. I'm starting to think Gwen might be right about me. Well, at least she'll be happy the fact that it's not a half-naked woman, right? I mean, that's progress in a direction, even if it's not the direction she wanted. All right, but you got to pull your own weight. What are your skills? I can give you a perm. Oh, and I can comb a nice fringe. So he's a hairstylist. What? You see, I, Theophilianis von Totenkrus, have always wanted to be a hairdresser, but fate dealt me a cruel hand. My vampiric condition did not mesh with my destined profession, so I chose evil. Part of the image, no. Well, why couldn't you be a hairdresser that's also undead? I mean, there's probably like a dozen books written exactly with that kind of protagonist in mind. My guess would be. I don't know. I, I don't read the romance section, but, you know, every once in a while it's good to brow browse around and look at the backs of different books. Yeah, I don't have an excuse. Sorry. Um, I don't think you're doing a very good job at it. I know. That's why I need your help. Just a small chance. That's all I'm asking for, noble sir. Ah, such a riveting tale of crushed dreams and forlorn hopes. This definitely calls for proper action. Griffith, what? <laughs> what? Are you two, like, having a moment here? Do you need a moment alone, Griffith? Are you okay? Are you fallen madly in love with a vampire? It's okay. I mean, you're blonde. You kind of kind of expect that you said, I'm not I'm just making blonde jokes for no reason. Sorry. Sorry. Okay, okay, you're in. Really? Kay is also suffering from Griffith's... I don't know what. It must be by osmosis, whatever it is. You won't regret this, sir. Let's go, then. I mean, a vampire on the team could be good if he has, like, any kind of powers whatsoever. Or, you know, it could be not good at all. I guess we'll find out. Let's go back to the castle. New characters fight at your side. Yeah, so Theo can fight with us. Well, I mean, we'll now have a sixth member, right? And we'll see how that works out. Let's go here. We've already completed the quest, so we're done. Now we can burn these 28 days doing whatever the hell we like. I think I'd like to do fishing. Yeah, let's go into the castle first. Any luck out there? We found a batch of files belonging to Duke Robert. Surprisingly, a lot of it consists of sketches. Sketches? I think so. I wasn't able to make sense of it. Hmm. Uh, can you take a look at it? You're better at this stuff than I am. <laughs> Please. You know it's important. Fine. 
After all, I volunteered anyway, I guess. Thanks a lot. That was actually surprisingly easy. And? Some files are missing, and I've likely overlooked certain things on such a short notice, but... It appears our Duke Robert Lauren was pretty well respected. Those family records constantly address him as Master Architect and the Great Constructor. Hell, he practically built this castle from the ground up. Oh, that explains the sketches. They were blueprints. That's right, but that's not the best part. In the end, those are just means to pay off that terrible debt. And with what you brought us, we may have uncovered something interesting. Oh? There's a missive about a vault being commissioned under the Duke's orders. These are his pointers on security measures he designed himself. Doesn't it strike you as something valuable? Where there's a vault, there's treasure. Even if you're onto something, there's no guarantee that it still exists. Or that it existed in the first place. I mean, there are plans, not... Yeah, I mean, there, he could have planned it and then died before it made it into fruition. There's no guarantee that the vault's actually anywhere. Truth be told, I'm skeptical as well. It may very well be a wild goose chase. But hey, okay, beggars can't be choosers. Also true. So then, what exactly do you suggest? I don't believe in golden tickets. But I'll try to look further into this when I get the chance. Now we know what questions should be asked, so we'll be able to hunt for more than a vague promise of help. Meanwhile, you just do your thing and soak the blows from Crucy and the Unity. Standard fare, really. Gee, thanks. You don't remember Unity was the workers group? Crucy was their leader. Workers group, group of farmers, whatever the hell you want to call it. Okay, another day gone, but I think all requests are done. We actually did that in record time, but only because we worked at it. So let's see, quests, kingdom quests, we'll just make sure. Yeah, check marks on both of them, we did it. Huzzah, okay, good. So I'd really like to do the fishing thing. I'd like to figure out what the hell that is. Um, we could theoretically also upgrade some things. So let's see, we could get maybe get something there with Alice. Go back in here and see if we can build something. Don't need to travel anywhere right now. I also haven't gotten any diplomacy missives in a while. Alright, so we could maybe upgrade the castle? No. Okay. I'll try. We wanted to upgrade the end, didn't we? Okay, we have a lot of Dilac. Yeah, we can totally do this. Confidant and Meyer levels of Baz and Lika, sure. That's one more day gone. Can't do the Alchemist lab, but you don't have an Alchemist. Can we do the pier? Nope. Smithy? Can upgrade the Smithy. We get a little bit better with Gunther here, so sure. I think the town square is already like up to, yeah, it's max construction level, okay. Merchant house? I can totally do that too. We're gonna be a little short on stuff here, but that's okay. Okay, can't do the Mystic Tower, we can't do the Prospector yet. Pathfinder, we do not have enough stuff because we need more Dilac. All right. Okay, so that's all we can do there. Back to the castle. So basically, we're just trying to stay ahead. Um, let's see. So, Diplomatic Missive. There we go. What do we got? Crop Politics. Okay. Clumsily written parchment lies before your eyes. It's scrawnly, barely legible letters conveying a certain measure of frustrated haste. Hello, my name is Anna. My husband and I, we are subcontractors of the Knights Pyram of Lordemar. For nearly a decade, our farm in Dumark Pass has grown a rare strain of curia plants that these knights like to use to produce their elixirs. It's good, honest work. Well, it used to be. The other day, the Dumark Leve broke. Levy? Leve? Anyway, thing that holds back water. Flooding our currently current batch of crops and destroying much of our equipment. 
Needless to say, we were devastated. As if things weren't bad enough, Shadurian emissaries appeared, claiming personal responsibility for the land because of our farm's closeness to their borders. They also claimed they could replenish the crop more easily with magic. The kicker is, now we have an angry relief unit of Knights Purim who threatened to throw the mages out by force. For the new ruler of the Expanse, please help us fix this mech somehow. Okay, so I don't remember where we are with this. Let's uh, let's close this out. Lord Amar, Lord Amar, Lord Amar. Okay, so we were against the Shidu, right? We were going up against. Yeah, we were. We we're helping Lord Amar, I think. Yeah, that's the check mark right there for Lord Amar. So we should continue along that route. This will push us up to level two, probably. Dash of Lord Amar and trinkets. Why the hell not? All right. So yeah, let's 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 help him out. It is politically advantageous and also happens to be the right thing to do, which is always nice when that you know lines up with politics. Do it. Let the knights organize a rebuilding effort. There you go. Reputation increased with the Lord Marians. Everything else, right? Issue resolved. Issue resolved. Yeah. Okay. All right. King's Quest updated. New characters. Okay. Good. Um, I do want to fish, and I think we can only do that with somebody. We go to the inn and do the personal bond there. Wouldn't necessarily be a bad idea. Where the heck's the other guy? Here he is. Personal bond in. Yeah, this guy. Shichi. Should be able to go to him. Okay, so he's supposed to be at the end right now. So let's go leave the castle. Go to the end. Assume he actually is there. Yeah, there he is. Let's spend some time with him. See if we can do some kind of fishing quest. Spend the day, sure. Let's do it. He's a little surprised. He was taking a nap. Wondering what the hell we're doing. Okay, you actually gonna talk or something? You decided to spend this day with Shichi. Okay, good. And was that it? I just don't know how the heck we're supposed to fish. That was it. We didn't... Okay. That was weird. Let's go to Town Square. Kind of weird that the vampire's out in the Town Square in the middle of nothing. Uh, I'm telling you, for the last time, you can't set up shop here. This is a well-established business zone. Nobody needs your services. Hmm. <sighs> is that so? I mean, potions, notions, elixirs? That's so six centuries ago. Who needs those anymore, am I right? We understand each other, yes? No, I do not understand. <sighs> well, watch my fingers, for I'm about to send you one very clear message. <laughs> watch my fingers? Watch my fing- Oh, because he's going to flip him off. Okay, I get it, I get it. Gentlemen, is there a problem? <laughs> no, no, not a problem at all. Uh, just a casual chat. There is no need to get involved at all, Sir so Lauren. Sir so Lauren? As in, Lord K. Lauren? Uh, might you be the one in charge? <sighs> Sometimes I talk too much. Indeed, that's me. And you are? I am a scientist. That's... vague. It's a matter of ethos. I believe in science. I exercise science. Hence, I am a scientist. I exercise science? You can say I do science. That's okay. But exercise it? I don't know. I'd be weirded out by anyone who says they exercise science. So I'm already weirded out by this guy. I'm a dirty competitor. What might that science be? Alchemy! I brew concoctions for any and every occasion. As questions, as answers, as problems, as solutions. There's a difference between a swamp herbalist and a devoted alchemist. I am proud to emphasize that difference. I thought maybe he was going to say he lives in that middle ground, but okay. I see. And what does an alchemist require of me? A place to practice my trade. 
My previous laboratory imploded on all known planes of existence. An unfortunate kerfuffle among my assistants. Nothing overtly lethal. Still unfortunate. Overtly lethal? So they died a slow and painful death in their beds as opposed to being instantly vaporized? All right. I mean, I suppose... No, no, actually, that's not better at all. Nope, nope, now they say it out loud. No, that's actually horrible. Hmm, a potion brewer. An alchemist, I insist. Right. Well, I'd certainly be glad to have you. I think an alchemist would be an excellent addition to our town. If he can give us health potions we can use in battle, yes. Otherwise, probably not. But try not to blow up anything this time, okay? Dare you not. Mistakes have been made. Mistakes won't be repeated. No assistance this time. It's easy to handle such delicate substances by myself. Let's hassle, too. This is excellent. You are excellent. This decision is excellent. Everything is excellent. A little overzealous there, but okay. I'll get to work right now. Um, you don't have a place? We need to build you a- Wait, wait! Where are you going? We need to get you a proper lab first. Yeah, thank you, Gay. Hmm. Consider staying at the inn, meanwhile. Ah, an inn! Does it have proper distillation facilities? I'm gonna lean toward no on this one. Yeah, pretty unlikely. No matter. The end then. I will wait. Uh, a moment again? It occurs to me that you never told me your name. Oh, my name? This is getting weird. Why do you sound surprised? Surely you must have a name. Yes. It's Riel. Alright. Riel. Nice to meet you. You can go now. Man, does that mask creep me out. I mean, hopefully he doesn't sleep in it, but I understand why he would use it. But why be out in the world with it? Unless his lungs have gotten used to all the chemicals in the air. That's just weird. I don't understand. Anyway, this is... Alchemist House would be... Oh, uh, it's probably the one with all the pipes. Yeah, above the smithy. Okay. Well, let's see if we can build it. I don't think we have enough DLC to do it, but we can try. And if we can't, then we'll talk to the, uh, talk to the vampire. Then we'll probably need to do, probably need to go out in the world. Alchemist Lab. Yeah, not enough DLC. Okay. So. Okay, back to the castle. Let's at least talk to the vampire. See if we can get his, um, a biat. Armory. Where is he at? He's in the armory. Okay. Good, good. Let's go down there. Okay, let's talk to him. Hello, Theo. I know more about you. How wonderful to see you. What to talk? Are you free right now? Okay, we do want to spend time. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm not doing his accent. It's not gonna happen. Huh? He was not here. Well, he was here like two seconds ago. All right then. <laughs> okay. Hi. Right, that's a neat trick. Well. Well, what? Are you scared? Um, no? Eh. At least you're honest. Anyway, do you think maybe with a little practice? Mm. I don't know, maybe. I think maybe you lose the boo. The only reason why you wanted to meet me here? Um, no. Yes, please don't get mad. Very important to me. I want to be scary. I want to be terrible. I have a reputation to maintain because what kind of vampire would behave like, well, me? Well, you. You can be your own version of a vampire. You don't need to play to this tropes, man. You're fine. But if you want to be a hairdresser, I guess, you can still be a hairdresser, too. What's wrong with being a hairdresser? Nothing. That's always been my unlifelong dream. All but unattainable, though. I mean, for God's sake, it's peripheral mirrors and exposed necks. Oh, okay. I could see the temptation there. I mean, the mirrors would be weird, but on the upside, on the upside, um, you could have a mirror in front of your client 
and then even though you stand in front of your oh no actually that won't work i was gonna say even though you stand in front of your client the client will still be able to see their own reflection that doesn't actually work because they still have to see past you their own reflection so that doesn't actually work but yeah yeah okay i can see some problems with that that'd be all do you want to talk about something <laughs> yeah k's bag of small talk oh my I would know. I don't really like sunlight. You were out in the town fucking square. All right? Unless it was a cloudy day. Right. Awkward, isn't it? And that was it. But at least we bonded a little bit there. Okay, let's look at... Yeah, personal bond goes stronger. I mean, C now has ravenous reach. Okay, we gotta test him out. We gotta do it. We'll go out in the world next, I think. Um, let's see who else we have. Let's see who else we have for bonds. Um, let's see, so. Signy, but I don't think we can actually bond. Let's see. So, Alice, we're getting closer there. If we get a little more time with her, but this is still locked. I don't know what unlocks this. Um, well, no, all these are still locked, but... Gunther should be up to buddy level now because of Smith is the way it is, right? Maybe it's just locked until we get the rep. Um, let's try to make things at Gunther's place really quick. Now we have that option. That'll probably be the end of the episode. I just want to see what we can do in terms of crafting. Um, I'd like to talk to this guy. There you go. Fine day, yes? I would like to sh craft weapons, please. Okay, so. Oh, yeah, we totally have enough. So we can make, like, an arcane lens. Okay, okay. No, I'm liking this. 4% fire generation. That's... I like these. Fire penetration. So this would be really good for Alice. Yeah, weapon Alice. Okay, all these are weapon Alice, actually. I'm back conductor. I don't know, the fire penetration just sounds better. Yeah, why don't we do a combat conductor here? Actually, we're gonna filter by... I mean, regular, we need like 30 regular weapons. Oh, that's all these are, okay. That's okay though, that totally works. Okay, so yeah, so give me the combat co conduct. Ah, uh, no, the bejeweled focus. I like the fire penetration, let's do it. And craft. There you go. Okay, and then for Griff. Oh, uh, more accuracy would be pretty good, but the stream blade here. Must be shapeless, formless like water. 3% dodge, 2 initiative, 5% damage. I don't know that the accuracy, I think. Because he's been missing the dogs a lot. I don't know how else to improve that aside from doing this. The captain's blade, let's do it. Let's see, I think we already have Cutter and Flinger, so... And it misses a lot. We don't really have any way of improving that accuracy. I don't know, it's not really important. How about Levant? Oh, these are pretty good. Negative effect resistance, damage. I mean, the damage for Levant is not actually ever going to be that high. So I think just being able to tank is pretty good. So the Steel Pavis, let's do that. And Signy, I think, already has the Prowler's Hands, but the Two Talon might be better. Oh, no, there's no way she has the Prowler's Hands. I'll put you Steel Point. That's, oh, minus two initiative, though. So she'll always go last. But the Shield Points and then the damage on top of it. Oh, but 3% dodge can make it so she doesn't need shields, right? That might be better. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, and then for Theo, you're a brand new guy. What can we do for you? Harvest Watcher. We can't actually build that yet. We can't build any of these yet. Yep, yep. Can't do any of these. We want to have to DLC. Okay, but that's okay. We can eventually get that. So, thank you. Much appreciated. Uh, we should look at Signy and get you your... Yeah, so you just have the claws. There you go. Oh, we have two talent. We have two two talents. 
Oh, yeah, that feels dumb. And we still need to do it anyway because we did need to um, Gilded Blade. Percent to re resist blinded. Actually, pretty good. Thunder resistance, ice penetration, fire resistance. Where's your... Oh, no, this is... We need weapons. Yeah, Bejeweled Focus. There you go. Might as well give you a third thing. Ice penetration is not going to help. Um, fire resistance yourself, I guess. I don't know. Griffith. Okay, he already had a stream blade, so trade over to Captain's Blade. Which just improves your accuracy. Everything else remains the same, but that's okay. We should probably just sell these things. Levant, change out your tower shield for the Pavise. Everything else should be fine. Theo, you have your gaudy old scythe, which we need to trade up. Um, you know what? Yeah, you get the gilded blade there, and... Some divine inheritance there. Right, empty perk slots. You need to fix these. Then the range, yeah, I guess. Get your shields up. Get the dodge and initiative up. Shields per turn. Ravenous reach and quick thinking. Actually, maybe the damage? We don't know if he's a damage dealer or not. I guess we'll find out. Okay, let's go to the merchant then really fast. I want to see if we can sell this stuff. Merchant house. Because we have a bunch of stuff just lingering in our inventory. We might as well sell it all. Um, though the merchant's not here. Fuck you. Okay. And we go to the pier and see if we can fish. Igni's there, though. I don't want to get wrapped into another thing. Let's see. Oh, here we go. All fish you catch doubles consumables concoctions. As such, fishing can be used in an expensive way to gain combat supplies. Fishing allows you to catch more other fish. Items, trinkets, vendor junk can be found too. Interacting with the fishing tools on the pier will trigger the fishing day, consuming one in-game day. You have five fishing attempts per each fishing day. Your success chances and total number of attempts can be modified by applying special fishing baits. I believe these baits can be bought from Haksun or crafted by your town alchemist. Got it. We can totally fish here. All right. Um, assuming there's a fishing mini game. Yeah, start fishing. We have no actual bait. Oh no, we do. Regular bait. There you go. Start fishing. Is there a mini game here, or is it just watch this guy fish? He's just bobbing. I mean, there must be a mini game here. Yeah, here we go. Nope. Okay, now I need to click a lot faster than that. What was me? All right, let's try. That. Uh, we don't have any fish. All right, fine. Or no bait, rather. Okay, so there is a mini game here. Just as soon as it bobs, we need to click like mad. Apparently. Yep. Click like mad. Click like mad. Click like mad. Click like mad. There you go. There you go. Just gotta keep them there. Keep keep them there. Come on, don't, don't go too far out of there. Keep him there. I'd tire him out, but it worked. On a zone of flames, it deals 40% base damage is fired to anyone passing or standing in the area effect. Wow. Okay. We can do this, like, all day. Sure, why not, right? Why the hell not? We get items from it. We might get trinkets. Who knows? Look like mad. Stay in the zone. Stay in the zone. Don't don't do anything. It's funny. It looks like the fish has a snorkel. That's actually the hook. Dragon carp. And thirty-five percent of weapon damage is fired. All targets turn into effect. Okay. I like the bait is optional. It's weird, but I kind of like it. Standing on the net seems like really a bad idea. What if your foot gets caught in there? Come on, there you go. Come on, just stay there. Just stay there. Don't go too far. Don't go too far back. We're good. 
Another oil fish. Who the hell is applauding this? That's what I want to know. Is Kay doing this to a live studio audience? Because that's what, kind of what it sounds like. Click it, click it, click it, click it. There we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. Just stay there. Just stay there. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Okay, the timer does reset if he goes outside the bounding box. There we go. Destroys all shields on target enemies in the area effect. That's actually fantastic. Could be fantastic. One more attempt here. That is a chance to be really good if we get like a heavily shielded bad guy. Okay, so fishing's totally worth it. And... Okay. Plus one duration of positive effects and plus 15 negative resistance. That's really good. That's it for the day. That is not so bad. We should do that more often. Okay, that's cool. Alright, that'll do this episode. Thanks for watching. This has been Regalia of Minimonarchs. I'm PC Universe, your PC Universe 2. I'll see you guys next time.